And Good uh, morning. So what, what's going on there? there still, you. still very cloudy. Well, yeah, it is a little bit cloudy, but you know what? I think I'm getting a bit of a tan with the sun. It's coming <laughs> through, guys. It's coming through. As you can see, I am on the French Riviera. Look at this. The preparations are all going on for Trolls, the movie, a little bit later on. Apparently, Justin Timberlake is going to be on that red carpet with full life Trolls. I so need a selfie with a troll. I think you was a more of a My Little Pony girl, Holly, don't you think? Yeah. Uh, also, <laughs> over here, have a look. This is the Carlton Hotel. This is where all the junkets happen. This is where the stars come. I've been interviewing all day. I've got so many interviews today. I'm so, so excited. If that's called the Quasette. Uh, and down there uh, is the Palais des Festivals. And for people who don't speak French, that means the Palace of Festivals. Just for all you out there. That's You're where fluent. I thought for a minute I was talking to a French film person. Premieres. Well, yes, I have been practising, Philly. Uh, that's where it's all going to happen. It's so exciting. It's so exciting. But the A-listers are arriving, and Philip Schofield, your, your twin, has arrived. Mr oh, George Clooney. Clooney is here with his lovely wife, <laughs> his lovely wife, Amal, and she, she looked absolutely stunning. In fact, sunglasses, she had a nice cream top on, a little poofy, stripy skirt. I think she got the memo, actually. I've got the stripes on. I'm so in fashion at the moment. Uh, then there was Eva Longoria. She landed embracing the sun with her little cheeky, stripy dress. In fact, I might see if I can get a selfie with her and we we'll do a face swap, because I can see myself looking good in that dress. Uh, Julianne Moore has arrived for the L'Oreal campaign. She looks amazing. I'm quite excited to see what sort of parties she gets up to, what she, what she does. And also Blake Lively. I love this woman. She's so, so beautiful. Uh, uh, pregnancy is obviously really suiting her at the moment. She arrived. She's documenting this whole thing on Instagram. So if you go on Instagram, you can see what she's getting up to. But, yeah, it's been amazing. Uh, the junkets are in full swing. The red carpets are being laid. And uh, the first premiere tonight is Cafe Society. Now, this is the big Woody Allen film. I'm so excited by this. I've already bagged myself a Woody Allen interview yesterday. He was absolutely lovely i'm not supposed to show you this until september but would you like to see a little sneaky yes, yes, peek please, of our yes. okay well, he here's wrote a little and directed this peek. movie he was even the voiceover in this movie what i want to know did woody allen the director have any problems with uh, woody allen the writer at all and if so what did woody allen do about it uh, i never have any conflict uh, when i when i've acted in my movies there was no conflict between woody allen and the actor the writer and the director, we love each other, we sleep together. It's, I mean, it's, it's a wonderful, wonderful situation. He doesn't do very many interviews, to be honest with you, but he was such a lovely guy. He was everything I thought Woody Allen was going to be. He was funny, he was witty. I just thought, I was in awe of him, if I'm honest with you. He was just lovely. And I can't wait. I can't wait to see him again on the red carpet tonight. Well, the, sun, the sun's coming out right it's behind you. Yeah, so it's beginning to look absolutely stunning. What else are you doing? I know, I'm so excited. Yeah, well, there's lots going on today, actually. I'm uh, interviewing Christian Stewart today for Cafe Society, also Blake Lively. I'm also interviewing, um, who else? Uh, Jesse Eisenberg, so that's going to be amazing. Uh, George Clooney, I've got an interview with George Clooney uh, at the end of the week, and also Julia Roberts. I do have to share him, unfortunately, with Julia Roberts. That's for their new movie, Money Monster. Do you, do, you want, do you want me to give you a little montage? I've got a little highlight montage. We love a montage. Have a look at this. Let's have a look. Hello YouTube, for more of the same just click here and don't forget you can subscribe for even more of these amazing videos exclusive to our channel. Jared Leto, who I met for five minutes, okay, he's a huge fan of Matty, my son who's in the 1975, so I found myself next to him at Coachella in this sort of artist enclosure, you know, stars galore everywhere and I'm stood next to him and I waited till he made the minutest eye contact and went, I'm the mum, <laughs> like this. <laughs>